Alice TV. Today's video is going to be really different and I'm going to be talking about what I would change about pet shops and this doesn't apply to all pet shops this is just my opinion on some pet shops and if I had the chance to change a few things about them this is what I would do. So the first thing that I would change is the size of the cages that they sell and I think this is a really big problem obviously if you think back many years ago they have increased the size slightly since then but I still think they could do with increasing them a lot more imagine living somewhere that small for your whole entire life and never going anywhere else just being kept in this tiny little enclosure with nothing to do nowhere to move around and they can't fulfill their needs and they can't live a happy life in a small tiny little cage and I just think it's really really cruel and it's not right. Some of the cages are okay but I haven't really come across many that are exactly suitable and I think if they did increase the sizes it would really benefit a lot of small animals. The vast majority of people these days buy their small animals from pet shops so they should be setting a good example of what a small animal should live in and I don't think they should be selling things that are inappropriate. So the second thing that I would change is how easy it is to get a small animal and I think that it shouldn't be easy because you don't know the responsibility that comes with the small animal and you don't know how committed you need to be to look after them and it should all be addressed this information before you get the animal so you know what you're letting yourself into really and it's totally different when you're going to adopt a cat or a dog because then like they come to your house, have a look around, make sure you're a suitable owner, make sure that you have enough room to keep this animal and just make sure it's the right home but at pet shops they'll probably just sell you any animal, tell you a little bit about them and then just let you have them and that just isn't right, it should be a lot more difficult to get small animals and it should just be like getting cats and dogs, it's no different, it's still a living animal and it should be just as difficult. So the third thing that I would change is some of the information that they give you and sometimes this is correct, other times this is incorrect and it's no good giving out incorrect information because this doesn't help anyone so if all the information that they gave was correct it'd be a lot better. Also I would change how old the animals are when they come into the shops because I do think that they are often too young. I always see these tiny tiny guinea pigs and they're still babies, they still need to be with their mum. The final thing that I would change is some of the things that they sell and the first thing I'm going to mention is their treats and a lot of the time these have really unhealthy ingredients in them especially the, the treat sticks that you can get for guinea pigs they also contain seeds which aren't suitable for guinea pigs and um, so I think it would be better if more research was done before listing it suitable for certain types of animals. I do think that pet shops are very useful especially if you just want to pick up some supplies and they can sell some really good products at them and they're really great if you just need to pick up some pellets or some hay it's really convenient if you have just run out and you need to get something quickly and you don't want to wait until it's delivered to your house if you buy it online it's very useful just as somewhere you can go if you need to get some supplies quickly thanks for watching this video it was a little bit different to what i would normally do but let me know what you would change about pet shops in the comments bye guys